Some people claim that when you go into a caloric deficit, your body goes into starvation mode and holds on to or even gains body fat. When you diet extensively, there can be certain physiological adaptations that make weight loss harder. Your appetite can go up, your caloric requirements can go down, and the amount of movement you do on a day-to-day -day basis can also go down. Caloric restriction research shows that weight loss occurs in spite of these issues. For example, in the famous Minnesota starvation experiment, participants were on an aggressive caloric deficit and lost a quarter or more of their body weight. Likewise, if you look at photos of countries suffering from famine, it isn't exactly like they're struggling with the obesity epidemic. Now there is research for people who are on 1200 calories or less per day, yet struggling with weight loss. The reason? They actually weren't in a caloric deficit at all and they had misjudged their caloric intake. So we know that caloric restriction works consistently and reliably for weight loss. That is assuming, of course, that you are actually in a calorie deficit.